What's up guys, it's me, Kales from Kales Gaming here, and today we are back with another video. Today I've decided that I'm going to upload episode 2 of my room makeover. So keep in mind, my cable management is not the best. And I know I said this in past videos already and that's why I didn't want to upload. But you know, I'm going to be updating the cable management anyway. And that could be maybe another episode, you know? But um, I've updated my room even more, so I've decided to put just my setup in one video and then my room in the next, so then I, they're not too, it's not too long of a video. So I was thinking if I ever update my setup or room, I'll just add either add it into another video that I upload or maybe wait until there's enough to make another episode so then it's not like a two minute video. I know I do have some two minute videos out there, but you know, I want to make this actually kind of cool, the kind of um, episodes because I've never done like a, something like this and I'm finally s setting my room up now and it is looking really nice so I should have the episode 3 to it as well but I'm not sure when that will go up hopefully the week after fingers crossed if I keep editing it because yeah that's all I kind of have to say but um, hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to smash that like button and hit the subscribe button down below and I'll talk to you guys either in the outro or in the next video. So I'll see, talk to you guys later. Bye bye. What's up guys? We're now going to be doing the cable management and putting all the monitor and laptop and PlayStation up on the desk. Now, and hopefully it doesn't take long because it's not the best thing to do. We need to get it over and done with so we can play on it. But yeah, let's go. We're going to start off with just putting the mouse pad down so then we don't have to lift everything up and put it on top of it so it won't be in the way and everything. Then we're going to do the monitor. This is the monitor by the way, it's a handsfree one, it's supposed to be a gaming one but I'm not sure but yes, this is what I'm going to be using. I'm going to try to get a monitor arm for it next so then this stand won't be in the way. I'm actually just going to show you where I'm going to be putting the cables real quick. So I have a little like a thing over here that like you keep the wires together. I have another one over here too. Keyboard next. This is the keyboard I use. It's the Sonosa Chroma, the Razer Sonosa Chroma gaming keyboard. Obviously you can't see the <laughs> lights right now because it's not plugged in, but yeah. Next thing I'm gonna get is the mouse and this is the mouse that I'm using at the moment it's the Razer Death Other Essential it that actually comes with the keyboard and you get a mouse pad and a gaming headset too get the HD mine first That is what I look, it's looking like at the moment. I have them all coming through um, one of these things at the back of the desk. I'm just going to cable time. Next, we are going to put the PlayStation up, I think. Leave it here for now anyway and see what goes on little things I'm going to put on the back of here so for the PlayStation and HDMI thing. I have my Alexa I've, I think it's the I'm not sure which gen it is I just got it for Christmas I actually just got it for this Christmas but uh, I'm gonna put that over here my wireless charger to be honest, it's not the fastest thing, but it was kind of cheap, I guess. That's the reason you pay for it, you get. So as you can see, I usually have my light over here. So now when I'm doing schoolwork or anything, I have that. I think I want to get a better one. That's what I have for now. I'm going to actually plug that out and bring it back down to where I had it so you can see where the cables are. Because you can kind of see it's not the best. So I'm going to plug it out and leave for last. And you might not see it in the video. But yeah, 
Yeah, and then I'm going to start plugging everything in and putting them in the right way. So I have this, it's a four plug extension lead, but what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to put the laptop up so I know where I'm going to put the keyboard and mouse. Uh, no, what I'm going to do is I'm just doing this so I know where to put the keyboard and mouse. This isn't what it's always going to look like, so say maybe when I'm using my PlayStation I can put my laptop away or like something like that, so it won't always look like this, but sometimes I use this over here so then it'll actually sit up a good bit and not just be like... I have my mouse one here I have sitting there because I think I'm going to cut this one off and actually leave this separate because this needs to go all the way over to this side but at the moment even if I put it up here as you can see it doesn't fit so if I put it back up there it won't fit either so I'm going to actually cut this one off and then put a new one on but I'm going to keep leave the mouse one off it where did that go? Oh, there it is. So I'm gonna keep this one out of it. See if that works at all. I'm gonna have to find out what to do with this. So I might have to like put another one around up here somewhere and try to hold it up or maybe get something new to hold all the wires up together. But yeah. So that's them there. This is the keyboard, so we're gonna let that kind of loosen. Click that and see if it works. Oh, we fell. So I'm just going to show you that. It's down there. So I'm just going to show you up close. This just sits in here for a second. Here. So what I've done, I've actually made it looser. So it's like that. The only thing is that these actually keep losing the vitamin. But uh, it's not as tight now. So I just put it back here. But yeah. Velcro strap to get like the extra bits because that was like hanging over here. <laughs> So now what I'm going to do is grab another one of these. How many have I used already? <laughs> and I'm going to stick it up here to have these all, well, not up there, but like up the back. And have them up there. I think. I'm not sure yet, though. The thing is, I, what I did because it was kind of awkward, I added another bit of velcro to actually connect them to the rest of the strap. And then I just put them both up into this little thing here. And I was really bad. Uh, cable management but it's until I get a PC so then I don't have to like talk and change between a lap the laptop and the PlayStation so what I did is bring the HDMI up here and I just let that hang loose so then I can actually put into the laptop for school stuff so yeah that's what I've done so far and then I just have to these down here So as you can see, we've swapped it up a lot. We've changed the PlayStation from there to there, and we've actually moved the Alexa away. We've got rid of the laptop because we only put the laptop there when we need it. So we can either put the laptop over here, or maybe just like switch it out. I'm not sure yet. But um, what we've done so far, we are not using this one at the moment because we changed the PlayStation over, and then we made a new one back down here. So then, right here, the lap the monitor it isn't that badly. Like you can't see the cable. Like it doesn't look terrible. What I'm trying to say. And then, so what we've done with the keyboard and mouse is that we've left them two cables free along here because these are the ones that are going to be like going between the laptop and the PlayStation. So that's why we left them free. Next for the PlayStation is we have the, these two traveling down here with the Alexa. And the Alexa is kind of just hanging up here. These, this is just all the Alexa cables, a lot of it. And as you can see, this uh, cake, this plug just keeps flapping because of the battery here. So, with the, what we're going to do is, so with the battery because it's so heavy and that's why this is bringing it down. What we did so far with it is that we've kind of just put these all together. So we just velcro strapped them instead of cable tied. Because I've tried a cable tie today, as you've seen already, but it did not work out at all. So we're going to try to keep away from the cable ties. Well, maybe use them once or twice, but yeah. So with the battery, we're going to get some command strips, stick it up up here. And then we can sort out the cables again, but we're going to get command strips tomorrow. That's what we've done so far. Also, guys, this is the next day, and we're after getting 
the command strips we got a two pack because I have to put my whiteboard my school whiteboard because we're going online on Tuesday so I just decided to make a school whiteboard while I have a little one over there for just like my daily stuff and then my school whiteboard's going up, up here so I'm going to be using the command strips to actually uh, stick the battery of the monitor up onto the roof of the desk so this is what we left off with yesterday we have most of our cables high enough to the ceiling like they won't be hitting off my knees so what we're going to uh, do with the cables first is try and get them out of the way of my knees so I won't be touching off them and then when, I, when I'm able to do that I'm going to stick them up closer to the, um, to the roof of the desk so then they're tidy and neat and they don't look like they're all over the place but as you can see here I have LEDs running across the whole desk just from there to back there and they're just they're only like 10 euro in home store more, so they're cheap, but they work, so, yep. So that's what we have so far. They're not, it's not gonna be in the way of my knees, but I still have the keyboard and mouse cables left out to the side, as you can see over here because this, these are the ones that are going to be switching from um, the PlayStation to the laptop. So I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these yet. I might just get a hook and hook them up whenever I'm not using them or I'm not sure yet. I think I might just let them loose and hang them at the back here. But uh, that's what we have so far done. And now I think we're going to try and maybe connect these to the roof a bit closer so they're so like they look a bit better. So I'm just going to show you what it looks like from like back to the wall and see what it looks like from there. From my height, you wouldn't notice at all, to be honest, when you obviously the few wires that are here, that's not going to be shown, that's just for the lamp, so that'll be moved in around to the back over here. But if we're going like this, it isn't like, say, even if you're to here, you're fine, but like, you get rid of all that up there, you just hide the ones at the back. Now, I know this isn't the best, but this is what it's looked like now. I just kind of put like two or three cables up. I know it's not the best and it's kind of thrown around the place and I just have like these little bits like everywhere and I'm not using them to like guide cables. I don't mind because I can just do it better another time. But yeah, like maybe when I actually get a PC, but this is what it looks like. So it's way better than the last time. But yeah, that's what it's looking like so far ideas on what I can do to improve the cable management or what I can do with my cables here for my laptop and my PlayStation, dirty keyboard and mouse cables, please drop in the comment section what I can do because I need help doing this and I know it's not that best of a job but you know what, it will do, I'll be fine. This is what the setup is looking like, by the way I am playing prop hunt in black ops right now because it just came up, came out. So. And as you probably know by now, I have been live streaming COD Black Ops 4. So if you would like to, please go and join my streams whenever they come on. Don't forget to put no notifications on so you do know when they come on. But I know it's messy now, but that's because school has happened. And I swap swapped uh, the, the laptop and PlayStation from side to side. To when I was on in doing schoolwork, I'll take that off. Well, that's what I have done, then move them back and forth. But this is what it looks like after all and um yeah hope you guys enjoyed the video don't forget to like and subscribe and yeah bye bye